Hello everyone, I'm here today to explain to you guys about my 5th week Steam project. I did my 5th week Steam project as a game which I made in Microsoft Make Code Arcade. And actually I didn't really make the project, well I used this project as my inspiration to build that project. So let's get started about how it works. First, I'm going to explain you guys the code, so ignore the screen over here. So on start, set asteroids, it's a variable, to an array of these stuff, which you can choose, there are many more stuff, but I chose that one for now. Add or take off stuff. Here, set sprite to kind of player. You can choose some of the sprites over here, anything that you want, and then set ship to stay in screen so it is going to stay on screen set ship bottom to 120 move ship with buttons vx 100 and vy 100 set life to 10 start screen star field effect on button a pressed set projectile to projectile which is over here and i can edit it but um yeah over here i can edit it i'm going to edit anything you want but i just edit it like that I'm gonna, as an example, I'm gonna edit one of it right here in front of you. And now, if I want um, brown, I'm gonna get brown over here. And what another color? Uh, maybe this one. Okay, this one. So, see, we just made our own. And I'm just gonna keep that. From the ship, which is known as the player, with VX0 and VY140. And projectile start fire effect, so it's gonna like, get up some fiery effects for every 100 milliseconds. And over here, on sprite, which is the player, overlap with an other sprite, which is kind of enemy, camera shape by four pixels for five, 100 milliseconds destroy sprite with disintegrate sprite start fire effect for 200 milliseconds so it's going to start fire effect for 200 milliseconds and that changes the life by one here on when button a pressed repeatedly set ship to invisible on set ship to ghost on when button b pressed re repeatedly set ship invisible off set ship ghost invisible t ghost off game update every 500 milliseconds set projectile to projectile asteroids get value at pick random zero to length of array of asteroids minus one from the side of with vx hundred zero by 75 set projectile to kind of to enemy set projectile x to pick random 10 to 150 then this part on sprite kind of projectile overlaps other sprite kind of enemy destroys sprite with warm radio effect for 100 milliseconds i can change this so i really want the more than 500 milliseconds destroy other sprite with disintegrate chain score by two let's see what my game does now we can edit it right now but let's just see what it does i'm gonna start the game well, I'm, I'm, I'm smashing all these guys right now. Whoa, this is so much fun. And see, I have a sp see, I'm gonna shoot down there. You want a special power to stay invisible? Oof. I'm over here, everybody. You guys can see me. I'm, I'm firing bullets from over there. See, that thing's coming on top of me. Oh, my life didn't change. But I'm gonna press enter. I'm back. And thoughts on me? Oh, my life started suddenly changing. I can also change, um, I can shoot, uh, stuff, that's right now I'm shooting, I can also use my power up again, invisible, boom, 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 and, I, and even if stuff hit me, I won't even feel anything, and my life won't decrease, now, let's change that, because it may be a bit too fair, um, invisible, and ghost off, and, but invisibility off, and ghost on, what if we try to do that, now let's see that out, I'm done pressing that, I'm pressing A, I'm invisible, but I'm not a lot. I can't, I don't have the ghost protection now. I gotta be careful, and it's much harder now because nothing is here right now to protect me. Because, like, my ship is in a humongous size, right? Press enter. See, my ship is of that size, and I can't do anything to protect it right now. But now, when I press B, I'm safe, but I'm not, well, I'm not, well, invisible. But I'm safe. Nothing can touch me. But when I press A, 
I'm not I'm not safe anymore. I gotta fire my bullets at my opponents. But I think it's not kind of fair, cause like I don't think that's really kind of fair, cause like when uh, you switch to B, you can't like go back to normal. That that's not what I think is really not fair. So what I do is that I turn on both of them on, and when at the time they're both of them off. That's I think is better. And this over here, you can see the effect of bubbles. I Me, mean, I like Blizzard kind of, so I'm gonna put on Blizzard. And as you see, kind of like snow kind of stuff. See, that's all like the blue white stuff. That's all snow. I'm gonna pause this game again. Or I can make it, um, let's make it confetti. Yes, confetti is good too. I'll make it confetti. See, confetti is coming down. See, now that's the confetti with including many different colors. So now it's better, right? You can also change it to your preference, but this is how I like it. So I'm going to make it to be like just like that. Um, next, uh, you can also change the stuff over here over here and you can like change up the whole game and here you can also change the updating time projectile fire you can change the effects to like warm radial so i'm gonna start the game so when oh when a is pressed see it's gonna like give you a uh, kind of warm colors not the cool colors that's what happens when you do that and now i'm gonna pause the game now Let's go back, and that's what you can do. Also, here, over here, this part, you can like change the life, like you can change the score extras, you can change the how they disintegrate, and you can make a sprite kind of um, player, and that one like do nothing. See, that means they well, they will harm your lives, but you will. Well, I'm pressing it too much, I guess, so I'm just enter. Oh, it's not working. Why not? It's not working anymore. Oh, why is it not working? And it's not getting affected. I can't even move. Why isn't that working? You know what? It's not working because this person is now the player. It's not an uh, enemy anymore. So they become player and now you're, they don't have a part anymore. See, now I'm okay. Now I'm good. I can do anything else right now. So that's better. And what anything you else you can do is that you can change the um, how they look. I just want it to be back to fire and how much they move. So I can make this to 200 and this one to 200. Oh, I also forgot to show you guys one thing. So it's like I can move forward. I can go backward too. I can see. I can. I can go for as much faster as I want. See, I can go faster. I can go slower. It's however I want. So I can go faster. I can go slower. I can. I can like. It's my preference. I can do anything that I want. My preference is that you gotta go at medium speed, which is um 100. The one thing I had in time to finish is that, uh, like, when they go down, their lives don't decrease. It's like the when is, it can't decrease. It only decreases when something hits you. That's the only part I wasn't able to finish yet. So, what I want to do is that I will finish this part later. And also, what you can do over here, move ship. You can make ship to projectile. And then say... When the projectile and shoot, you can pro move the projectile. See, you, the ship's not gonna move anymore because the projectile's over there. I press the projectile won't move anymore because it's gonna go the straight direction. And yeah, uh, even if I t if I turn this off, I'm gonna make this back to ship. Sorry, I'm gonna take this back to ship and I'm gonna take ship same screen off. Now you guys will see what's gonna happen. See, I'm gonna go off screen. See, I'm going off screen. Off screen. See, nothing's gonna harm me off screen. Like, it's like, it's kind of like the same thing that I have. See, I'm here now, but you still can't see me. That's kind of like a power up which you can use. It's kind of like a bug when you change the code, but it's pretty useful too. But I don't like it. I think it's kind of cheating, so I'm gonna turn that off. And. 
I think I went over all of it, and so let's just play the game once, and then let's end the recording. Okay, let's go. My highest score was like, well, it was pretty good, uh, but I'm really not satisfied with my score. I'm just gonna score. I'm gonna get a score of 50, and then I'm gonna end the recording now. See, uh, I like to like move my arrow keys and then shoot at the same time. I'm gonna power up. I'm invisible now. I'm a ghost mode, but I can still shoot in ghost mode. And that's my power. Oh, I already made the fifth score 50. Okay, I'm just gonna make 100 then. Uh, I'm just gonna make it go, 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 go. And I'm gonna press B. I'm back. Everything's back to normal. I don't have any special power ups. I can go off screen. Blah, 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 blah. I'm shooting everybody. And I have a score of 94. And I'm going, I'm gonna have a score of 98. And I'm 100. Okay, thank you everybody. Thank you for listening. Bye.